Hello everyone, it's Kim. Welcome back to my channel. And for today's video, we're going to be talking about the advices I wish I knew before going back to school or heading towards this ongoing chapter of learning. And this may apply to all grades or high school level to college students. This may apply to anyone who just wants to remember these advices when you're going through a journey such as this. So let's get started and don't forget to subscribe if you're new to this channel I post hopefully weekly and I'm trying to just keep up with the content to maybe inspire someone or to make a lifestyle video I'm really really spontaneous so let's get started what is school in the first place all right so the first thing that comes to mind when we're talking about the concept of school is to understand what school is all about in the first place so the number one thing that I wish I knew when I was like in a freshman year or just starting um, or finished elementary I really wished I understood what school is in the first place and for me it's such a privilege to go to school because it breaks my heart for people who don't have access to education or people who just really can't afford education or other things like that but we have to realize we are so lucky to have access to education and um, to me that's very exciting that's why I get excited to learn not necessarily mathematics or harder concept but the things that are very very useful in, in sense that you know you can use daily maybe it's learning how to talk to someone or as simple as applying it to your life makes it what makes it very crucial to have education and social circles just trying to get into the social circle and we all know this one but it's to choose your circle carefully because there's so many people that can manipulate you can take advantage of you and to overall just make you feel like you're not worthy so I really recommend you to hang out with people that make you feel inspired to you know just they really care about your well-being as well friends that are there for you um, I don't I don't think it's necessary to have like a pool or loads of friends than you know trustworthy ones so choose your circle carefully and find your study technique Alright, so number three is something that I've talked about before because I was still trying to understand what my study technique was or technique to use especially when there's exams coming up and I feel like a lot of people have their own technique without realizing it and as I mentioned in another video or I'll link it down below if you want to watch it but it's something that we use in our studying techniques whether it's audio visual kinesthetic or maybe handwritten there's like so many techniques that you know you can use to try to enjoy the process and try to understand that you can actually try to make studying enjoyable not a hassle try to find your own study technique do not pull an all-nighter all right, so something that's really funny when I wanted to like ace an exam or something and I thought that all-nighters would help like make me get a high grade because you're overstudying but it turns out I got the lowest grade because I pulled an all-nighter. So my fourth, just do not pull an all-nighter. Try new things. I highly, highly recommend is to not feel discouraged to try different things like school, you want to try a student body. I feel like people are so, I don't know, doubtful sometimes and fearful that, oh, they're not qualified enough and they're trying to jump into that experience. But honestly, if they don't try, how are they going to learn from that experience? So, and see for yourself. 
Let go of high expectations. So, just do the best you can and don't worry if you failed or failed it five times because really success is about trying. And I feel like the definition of a loser is those who don't try at all. So, be more of yourself. <laughs> do not change for others. Be more of yourself and do not change for the sake of other people. Try to change because you want to better yourself and try to find those discoveries about yourself. And that is so essential in kind of being better each day, not necessarily in a physical aspect, but in more on the personality or things that very pretty much last you a lifetime. I just you know, I think it's going to apply to so many people, uh, regardless of what level of education you are in, um, as well as just trying to remind yourself constantly what is school about. And you have so much potential without realizing it. Um, I really hope you contain so much faith in yourself to the point where you're just ready to face a new school year. And just don't put too much pressure in yourself i will work out so thank you so much for watching this video i hope you enjoyed it and i'll see you guys soon bye